Hey, Cancer, welcome to your reading. Um, I got a lot of decks out here today, but they're not all for you, so don't worry about that. Okay. <laughs> for those of you that are new, welcome. I am an energy channel. Um, I was getting some very interesting contrasting vibes coming into your reading. So we will see what's going on as an energy channel. Uh, it's a little bit of like scrying into the universe if the universe was like in a USB port in my brain. For those of you returning, you know my woo, right? Don't forget to like, share, comment, and subscribe. It really does help out the channel. And um, at the end, I will go to Patreon. Patreon is donation-based, so you can give what you can. You get extended, you get early access. It renews on the very first day of the month, and uh, you can choose to not renew at that time, right? Or you can renew. It's all up to you. That's why I have it set up in that way, and uh, it tends to work, okay? Uh, let's see here. For the collective... <laughs> You are stubbornly like, I am not going to transition my heart, mm -mm, right? But the only thing is, is that you ran into this, right? You rushed in, they're telling me here. And um, now that you're like trying to get grounded on these slippery emotional rocks, you're like, no, I, I did not. This is not quite what I asked for here, but they're telling me that's BS. They're telling me that you, <laughs> if you slow down and look at the past, like this is what you manifested, stress or not. You manifested this and some of you are like, no, I just want it easy, relaxing. Like I was manifesting like simplicity of love and abundance and spirits like, no, you did not address it that way. Okay, so let's see what is going on here for you. We're going to be looking at your overview, what's still impacting you from the past, current energies and future possibilities. Roles can be reversed. It could be the third party storyline. Okay, it also uh, may not resonate with you. Okay, just take what is yours and leave the rest behind. Okay. Thank you, Spirit. Underline Five of Swords and the Hermit. Again, judgment. <laughs> They're like your higher self knows. You chose this because there was a lot of healing that you needed to do. And yeah, you're kind of feeling like you're in a little bit of a storm right now. But they're like, yeah, right? Like, this is what you asked for. This transformation is what you asked for of your heart. The overview here is the Four of Wands. Okay, so um, it's like nose to nose with this energy that's very bound together in trying to be harmonious and celebratory towards each other but they're really showing me the kind of nose to nose sort of an energy like neither one is backing down what's still impacting you from the past the devil the queen of swords and the two of wands okay i get the energy here that again you there's a part of this where you're like you cannot see your part of breaking free from what could have been very toxic emotions. And you keep judging. Should I go back to the past? Should I go forward? Should I go back to the past? And they're showing me here, right? Um, it's almost like you're circling around, <laughs> right? Like there's this energy of almost a vulture sort of an energy. And yet, um, it's, 
you're waiting for something. I feel like in the next couple of weeks, you're gonna get your answer that solidifies what's still impacting you from the past. Okay, and here you are, current energies. You're like, I can't breathe in these emotions. There's not enough. And um, Spirit's kind of laughing at that because they've sort of trapped your ego so that you're stuck in this emotional warfare with yourself. And um, your higher self's just kind of giggling along, watching you feel like you're like, right? Like you can't take care of things that you're trying to take care of. And it's funny because you feel like people are annoying you like you're trying to get through the day and people are annoying you and it brings up more emotions and you're like shush up go away and you can't seem to break free right page of swords in the future possibilities i do feel like you're suddenly again you're gonna get this truth and then you're like smooth selling i'm out of here okay so let's take a look at this very interesting energy today, Cancer. Okay, Four of Wands. <laughs> the Six of Swords. Okay, you feel trapped in this energy, but you're like motorcycles on. You're ready to go. You're ready to move forward. Um, but you're kind of still stuck to this like couch that's attached to you like a sidecar. Okay, the Empress and the Six of Wands. You're like, I got rid of the devil, okay? I got rid of the old mindset. I am ready for my success. I'm ready to move forward. But there's this dreaminess of the past with this empress energy that you cannot quite seem to break free. There's this like fairy tale of what you thought you were getting or what you thought you had that's still swirling around there the devil <laughs> queen of cups okay again there's this part of you that's like i i just couldn't see that there was no love there okay i couldn't see it and there were all of these emotions and now there aren't any emotions queen of swords four of cups Now, it could have been that you just didn't have time for the emotions and you were stuck in a loop in your head. And there's this energy that the emotions got kind of pushed aside, right? You went very much inward, but not inward to the emotions. Two of wands. Yeah, what I say, the hermit. You went inward to this exploration, this growth phase. And in that darkness, you left the emotions behind. And that's probably what you're still trying to process now. The moon, 10 of cups, okay. You could have felt like this new space is a blessing but there's also with the hangman here this feeling that you cannot move again right your ego has been pushed aside so that you can process this and you are wounded and you are stuck in this wound and you, the more you're stuck in this the more you want to go into your cancerian shell right knight of pentacles and the more that that ache happens and the more that that tower starts to swirl outside. Page of Swords, Two of Cups, okay. There's an understanding here, right? The Three of Cups, that you did want love 
Okay. Eight of Pentacles with the Three of Pentacles, and there's the Tower. And there's the King of Pentacles. Hey, 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 Olive. Oliver, don't make me come get you. Come here. Come on, come read. Cancer wants you to come read. If you bark, I'll come get you. I can edit this video. We don't bark at kids on bicycles. That's so mean. Um, again, the truth is that you're going towards is that, yeah, I wanted love. I still want love. But there's something that is still in work. There's still the tower, I feel like, is that there's a realization that there is some sort of third party here that's blocking you, that you really have to deal with those emotions of being alone, okay? And, I mean, in the way it balances out, you're like, well, I'm alone, so I've got all the gold. King of Pentacles has everything, right? Like, I, I don't need anybody. I've got everything, but there's that four of wands here at the end, right? Like that loneliness, that is really what weighs on you, is that you don't really want to be alone. And it's almost like now that you've opened your heart, now you're like, now I gotta fill all of this, okay? Six of Swords, again, the tower, right? You're kind of stuck here revving your engine, Eight of Pentacles, until you do this processing to really see what's in the middle of all of this. Okay, this Empress energy, there's the Five of Swords. You get into this space where you're like, I don't want to listen to my higher self. I just want to move forward. I just want my success, right? Six of wands, six of pentacles. Why does everybody keep taking away from my moment, my success, my, my space where I'm not listening to all of you and it's just me and I'm happy and I'm healthy, right? Queen of cups, magician. Again, you were like the emperor, okay? I want the fairy tale. I don't want somebody that makes me feel rejected. I want the fairy tale. Four of cups, the moon in reverse. But you wouldn't go into those emotions. You wouldn't take that cup off the shelf because you were going into this very spiritually ascending energy here with the hermit nine of swords in reverse crossing i don't have time to think i'm getting intuitive okay i don't have time to feel i'm getting intuitive ten of cups king of cups your intuition showed you that what you want is love okay and that's what hurts the hangman and the chariot because all you want to do again that engine is revving all you want to do is rush into love but the more that it hurts the more you go inward and the more it goes inward the more it hurts that knight of pentacles seven of pentacles okay you know the potential here and that three of swords and the three of cups okay the three of pentacles it hurts because i know what i want and now i'm on the outside of it all and there's an unraveling and there's an energy between and it hurts that hurt is your new beginning okay two of cups Oof. Four, oh, it felt like a four of pentacles, but it's the page of pentacles. Again, you're kind of stuck with this almost moving forward, but you've got the energy of the new start, three of cups, 
king of wands okay you're transforming you're like a chameleon if you lost your tail it's growing back if you you know need to change colors to blend in there's a little bit of that going on this eight of pentacles nine of cups it's like you're waiting for someone to realize that you're the one you're the prize the three of pentacles here in the tower there's the four of pentacles in reverse there's a feeling of you're being rejected because you're not enough right if there's third party interfering whether it's work or actually somebody seeing someone else um you're not enough to take priority and that's where the hurt comes in is you have to value yourself in order to ask for that divine partner that you really want because you've got you king right we've got the king of pentacles the king of wands the king of cups it's the truth that you're missing we have the emperor here that you're trying to manifest into but it's the truth that you're missing about yourself yeah ace of wands rewriting old programming that's kind of what you're trying to do here the universe says right you do need to be a little bit guarded okay because you could be emotionally right yeah kind of cut in half here five of swords where the old pains become new pains and as new pains they become bigger And the father of wands takes over and you morph into what you are supposed to be instead of allowing the true you, this beautiful rainbow of energy to come up from the surface. All of this energy that you kind of worked into through this hermit work um, to come and show off who you are. That's how you attract the lovers. That's how you attract that divine soulmate is really by becoming who you are meant to be instead of trying to be what others want you to be. Okay. Yeah. Wizard of Awareness, right? Uh, the fates are kind of like, listen, we know you've been at this for quite some time. And yet in our timing, it's been a mere minute. But we're waiting patiently for you to get to this point of one, two, three, realizing what's left is that four. What's left is that knowing your worth. You've got everything that shows you your worth. It's just that you don't have that belief in yourself. And I get chills and that's a very old sacral energy that you are ready to release. Okay. So let's see what your soul wants to talk about in the extended. Okay. <laughs> the Eight of Cups. How do you release the past and move into this unknown? Okay. Yeah, the opportunity of alchemizing that end for something else is pretty great. But you have to understand Eight of Pentacles in reverse. It doesn't happen until you do the work to let those colors come to the surface. And that's what you're holding back on, right? You cannot step into this emperor's energy, male or female, does not matter, unless you realize, right? Like, you've given your all. That's why you've got this king of pentacles, right? Let that six of cups shine and start changing your perspective on who you are, okay? So we're gonna dive into that extended and look a little deeper into this. That link is down below. Don't forget to click on the thumbs up. I love you guys so much. 
and I hope to see you next time. Okay, bye.